Do you want to become a data analyst, but then you have no relevant experience before? No worries, because in this video, I'm going to talk about a certificate program which will teach you how to become a data analyst from scratch. And we're starting right now. So you want to become a data analyst, but have no prior experience in data analytics? No worries, because the recently launched Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate is created for those with no prior technical background. The goal of the certificate is to prepare you for an entry-level career in data analytics. And so the great thing about this program is that more than 100 companies has partnered up with Google and they're looking to hire junior data analysts. And so let's dive in into the benefits of the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate Program. Firstly, you'll be able to learn industry-relevant tech stacks of a data analyst, such as using spreadsheets in a technical setting, using Tableau, using SQL, and also using R programming to analyze data. Benefit number two, it assumes that you have no prior technical background. Benefit number three, the certificate is affordable and it is costing you at about $39 per month. And if you need it, financial aid is available. And so the next benefit is that you have the opportunity to work on a capstone project, which will allow you to build a portfolio. And another benefit is that upon completion of the program, you will have access to assistance in job placement. And now let's take a look at the cost of the program. So as mentioned briefly, the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate will cost about $39 per month. And so if you complete the program in six months time, which is the average suggested duration, it will cost you approximately $240. And so at the cost of $240, you'll be having access to job ready skills. So I definitely think that is well worth it. However, if you could complete the program in less time, it will of course be a lot cheaper. For example, if you could complete the program in two to three months, then it will cost you about $80 to $120. And now let's dive in into what will you learn from the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate. So the certificate program is comprised of over 180 hours of learning, which is broken down into eight courses. And so how will you learn from the program. It will be comprised of talking head videos where data analysts from Google and also product managers will be talking to you about the concepts of data analytics and also the various topics covered in the eight courses. And they will evaluate your knowledge by giving you quizzes, multiple choice, and also questions and answer. And at the end, you will be able to complete a capstone project, which will put your learning or newfound skill to the test. Because it is here that you will be able to build a project of your own, and then you could accumulate that in the form of a portfolio, which you could use to showcase when you're job hunting. So at a high level, topics covered in the Google Data Analytics Certificate program includes data cleaning, problem solving, critical thinking, data ethics, and also data visualization. So as mentioned briefly, the tech stacks will include spreadsheets, SQL, R programming, and also Tableau. And so let's take a high level overview of the eight courses that you'll be taking. So the first two courses will provide you with a high level overview of data analytics courses one and two. And then courses three and four will cover data preparation and also data cleaning. And so course five, you'll be using spreadsheets and SQL for data preparation. And then in course six, you'll be learning about data visualization by using Tableau. Course seven teaches you about R programming. And then in course eight, this is the capstone project that will collectively use all of the newfound knowledge that you have gained throughout the seven courses and put it to practical use in the project, but giving you the opportunity to create this capstone project. And so let's take a closer look. In course one, Data Data Everywhere, this course provides you with an overview of data and the day-to-day -day responsibilities of a data analyst. And the course ends by taking a look at the career path of a data analyst that you may take after completion of the certificate. In course number two, the course covers the important topic of arriving at data-driven decisions by asking the right question. 
And so this will essentially boils down to delivering data solutions to meet the needs and expectation of stakeholders. In course three, prepare data for exploration. So this course starts by covering data types and data structures. It then gets you started with the use of SQL for working with data, and it also covers data ethics. Finally, there's also an option for you to engage with the data community that allows you to learn about the importance of networking with other data analytics professional. And in course number four, process data from dirty to clean. This course covers the most important topic of data cleaning, which can be said to take up to 80% of a data project. And finally, the optional topic of adding data to your resume teaches you how to prepare an engaging resume that will highlight your strengths and experiences. Let's have a look at course number five, analyze data to answer questions. This course covers the use of spreadsheets and SQL for data handling, data aggregation, and also pivoting tables, etc. In course number six, you'll be learning about the basics of data visualization, how to use Tableau for data visualization, as well as how to craft a good data storytelling and presentation about the data analysis. In course number seven, data analysis with R programming, the course will get you up and running with R. R Studio, which is an IDE where you'll be coding R, as well as the important libraries such as Tidyverse. It will also cover R Markdown, which allows you to export R code as a shareable notebook and report. You'll be working on a capstone project that will allow you to collectively combine all of the newfound knowledge that you have gained and put it to practical use in this use case or case study in your capstone project. So the important question is, should you take the certificate? And so in order to answer that question, let's answer the question of who is this certificate for and not for? So the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate is for those who want to enter the field of data analytics. It is for those who have no experience or limited experience in data analytics. The Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate is not for those who already have extensive experience in data analytics, because perhaps you already know the tech stacks covered in the certificate, which as previously mentioned, include spreadsheets, SQL, R programming, and also Tableau. And also the certificate is not for those who are not able to dedicate enough time for the course. So if you wanna take the course, be prepared to spend consistent time and effort of at least two to six months in order to complete the course. And so if you're interested in taking this Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate Program, let's have a look. It will cost you $39 per month. And as I've mentioned already, if you could complete the course sooner, you'll be paying less. And the great thing is it is taught by Google and they provide an extensive network that will help you in your job hunting. But then please note that this is for those residing in the United States. And as you can see here, more than 100,000 people have already enrolled in this certificate program. So there is much interest by the data community for breaking in to data analytics with no prior technical experience by taking this particular certificate program. And so you could try out this program by clicking enroll. And so I'll provide you the link to this particular Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate. And so if you're interested in the program, you could try it out for free for seven days. And so it should be noted that if you're not interested in obtaining the certificate itself, you could just audit the course by going to the individual course. Let me show you. Click on the courses here. Go to the individual courses that you would like to take and then click on the enroll for free and then click on audit the course, the link here, audit the course. And so you'll be able to take the course for free, but then you won't be earning the certificate. And so there's nothing to lose. You just give it a try and see if you like it or not. And if you like it, then you could continue and pay the monthly fee and earn the certificate upon completion of the program. And actually, Google has released several of the videos that are used in the courses itself into their YouTube channel of the Google Career Certificate. Let me show you. Go to videos, 
And look for the thumbnail with the red color. And so here you can see that there's the video data analytics for beginners. There is five skills data analysts need. Intro to spreadsheets, databases, and query language. Spreadsheets and SQL for beginners. The power of data in business and some examples. Coca-Cola real world data analytics example. And that's all. And so notice that there are other videos from the other certificate program offered by Google. And so aside from the Google Data Analytics, there's also an IT professional certificate program as well, particularly the Google IT automation with Python. And so actually I've tried out the program for about two weeks, taking some of the early lectures from the first course. And I was pretty much impressed by the level of quality provided by the course. So for one thing, I'm a self-trained data scientist. And so being able to learn from this well-structured curriculum does provide some great revision of some of the topics in data analytics. And so if time allows, I'm also planning to get the monthly plan in order to complete the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate Program as well, because I think it provides me a quick and well-structured curriculum to refresh some of the knowledge in data analytics, as well as providing fresh perspective as a student, which will help me to engineer new courses for this YouTube channel, and also possibly creating educational content on various learning platform. And I hope that you're finding value in this video. Please make sure to smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and also make sure to hit on the notification bell so that you'll be notified of the next video. And as always, the best way to learn data science is to do data science, and please enjoy the journey.